Uh, like, you're disappointed because you lose a game. Um, what I like is we have great fight and character. What we've got to address is how we start games. As a trend now, can you put your finger on just the starting five you need to change, or is it the attitude of, of this team going into the game to be the hunt over rather than the hunt that's doing it? Yeah, that's, that's a great question. Um, I'll watch the game. I'll come up. Uh, watch the start of all of our games in the next couple of days to see if I see any one thing that sticks out. Um, and, you know, if we address that, we're going to address a lot of our problems. No, like uh, Monday night, everyone thought we were world beaters with the way we shot the ball. So, um, you know, if you're prepared to live with those shots on one night, you have to be prepared the next night. And I want players to shoot the ball confidently. Obviously, throughout the course of a game, you can make some little decisions. But, um, you know, you're talking about uh, Bryce Cotton and Corey Webster, two elite scorers in the league. Um, I have no problem with that. Jesse, obviously, Oh, yeah, I collected him pretty flush. Um, as I said in the radio interview, I didn't think it was dirty. Um, I hope he's okay, though. You'd never like to see someone go down like that. He looked absolutely cooked. Um, yeah, at least of all when you kind of caused it. So, um, as I said, I hope he's okay. Um, I haven't seen him after the game, but I'll follow it up. Um, and as I said, yeah, I didn't think it was dirty, but um, yeah, I hope he's okay. You're worried that when tribunal decisions Yeah, I mean, I don't want to preempt anything, but um, as I said, I didn't think it was dirty. I thought it was a screen, and um, yeah, I don't, I don't want to preempt a thing with the tribunal. I don't think that's my place to comment. But as I said, I didn't think it was any malice in it. I think it was a, it was a screen, and um, as I said, I hope he's okay. Is it hard for you to have that on your mind during the game at all? Like, having seen after the did we get the stat back straight into the contest? Uh, yeah, I mean, he, as I said, he looked pretty cooked, so. If I'm perfectly honest, yeah, it probably rattled me a bit, but um, yeah, yeah. As I said, you never want to see someone like that. How he was. What do you think, Danny? Are you worried that they might take that Not, not at all. Like uh, we're out there playing basketball. It's a common play in the game. Uh, as Jesse said, I really hope that he's okay. But to talk about a tribunal, I think that's a little anxious. get two teams that have a lot of pride within their franchise, that's the type of contest you're going to get. Can you talk us through um, the coach's challenge, the first coming in with, with Todd? Did Todd demand that as opposed to usually you can see one at that point of the game? Yeah, he certainly didn't demand it, but I trust my players and we went with it and I was good with it. Would you like one at the end? It looks like you're No, they did like once you use it, it does not enter my mind ever again. In a way, it's actually a relief because you can just get on with the game. Chance, your chance to be the only undefeated team tonight, so it's changed obviously with Sydney lose, the opportunity was there for you guys. Is that frustrating? Talk about protecting home court and stuff, but then the opportunity slips through your fingers in such a tight one. No, all we can worry about is the Perth Wildcats and how we approach a game and where we move forward from this game. So. Uh, unfortunate that we lost. We would have stayed undefeated. Where that sits in the realm of the ladder this early in the season, it's about us progressing forward at this stage of the season. We had a great opportunity, but 
um, we it really shows we can be a great team. As I said, we got great fight, got a great bunch of dudes that love to play for each other. But we do just need to address the start of the game, you know. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. Look, the way the way we're playing, it's only going to get better because our players are figuring out each other, the strengths and weaknesses of each other. Um, and I don't know what they ended up scoring, but once again, we had a great presence defensively. Um, so we're slowly building on that, and our offense will only continue to grow.